So this is me trying to write my name with my left hand. It's good, isn't it? I'm actually quite proud that I was able to do that. Um, writing with your left hand is hard if you are right-handed. And that's because you spend your whole time writing with your right hand and you, you, know, you don't have the muscle memory and you haven't developed the skills in the left hand. And the reason that I'm talking about writing with my left hand is because recovery from anorexia is a bit like writing with your left hand if you're right-handed or writing with your right hand if you're left-handed. You know what I mean? The other way around. It's like you basically have to do everything that feels completely alien and the opposite of what you're used to doing and what your brain thinks that you do need to do. So let's take, for example, my brain over the years had learned that the correct way to, or the appropriate way to deal with stress would be to restrict food. And I had to teach it that that was not any longer the appropriate way to deal with stress. That took a long time for my brain to learn that. That did not feel natural. That felt like writing with my left hand. Putting butter on my bread all the time, whenever I make something with bread, butter. That felt like writing with my left hand. Responding to hunger, even after having eaten a big meal, feeling hungry and then getting up and actually getting more food. That felt like writing with my left hand. Buying full fat everything and never buying low fat anything. That felt like riding with my left hand. Driving to the shops or wherever I was driving and not parking in the parking spot furthest away from the entrance of the place that I'm going to walk into. Instead, driving and parking to the closest to the place that I'm gonna walk into. That felt like writing with my left hand. Getting up in the morning and eating something straight away, even before breakfast, eating like before I do anything in the morning rather than getting up in the morning and going for a run. That felt like writing with my left hand. All right, so you get the picture. Just about everything actually felt different. Everything had, everything that I did had like a little taint of anorexia in it, whether it was an obvious thing like restriction or driving to the shops. It, everything was tainted and everything had to change. And so, you know, have you ever tried to write with your non-dominant hand? If you're anything like me, you try for about, I can just about get through writing my name and I'm like, this is too hard, I'm not gonna do it anymore. And you know what? Because I don't need to write with my left hand, I can get by writing with my right hand. And let's face it, most of the time now when I'm writing something, it's on an iPhone or a keyboard, I don't even really need to be handed. So it's not like this big desire that, or this big need that I have to learn to write with my left hand. So I can give up. I can just be like, this is too hard, I'm not gonna do it, can't be fucked. That's fine it's not gonna affect my life really adversely. Anorexia recovery, on the other hand, I had to do that. I was not prepared to continue to live in hell anymore. I had to do it, I had to persevere. And so it's like, you know how annoying writing with your left hand is. It's just like basically that over and over and over again, all day long without a break. You have to change everything and it all feels alien and weird, but it gets better, I promise. Just like, I know, if I spent more than 20 seconds attempting to write with my left hand, and if I actually put some effort in and I actually kept doing it, it would get easier. I know it would. Because my dad had a motorbike accident when he was 20 and he lost the use of his right hand and he had to change over and write with his left hand. And he's written with his left hand perfectly for, you know, after the first couple of years when he learned how to do it. So I know it's possible. I know that we can switch. But you have to put effort in. And it doesn't come naturally. And it's going to be really frustrating. But it's so worth it. So keep going.